Well, when we first started working to, together was when we were riding together. So she's very tough. You know, she's very, she has a mind like a steel trap. She doesn't forget anything. I was just talking to her and she said, didn't you read the email I sent you? And I said, no, you know I don't read emails. I'm computer illiterate. She goes, don't you do anything? I go, text me, text me. Um, she, she's a task mistress. She will have things, uh, she'll read the script and, you know, be smoking a cigarette and have it down in a day. And I, I'll hold the script right up to dress rehearsal. And, um, and she can be impatient, but along with that, it would push the part of me to be better and and try to be Johnny on the spot and, and it would be crisper because of her. And, um, but the, it, oh, it's just so difficult, but the, so then the attitude of the characters were real. You know, when she get upset with me, it would be real. And it just, I just, you know, let it roll off my back after a while and didn't get upset by it. But, um, we would always come to the same, as far as rhythm went, as far as the door flying open and both of us being absolutely in sync. I used to say to her, if there were an Olympic, an Olympic event for comedy, I think we'd take the gold. I used to say that to her because we just physically, we just do things, you know, and, and we'd always make each other laugh. Some of the best laughs of my life were with that woman. I mean, and if we made each, I go back to if we made each other laugh, we knew we would, would make the audience laugh also, if it made us laugh. And um, so we were very, very close like that. I mean, very, you couldn't slip a playing card in between us like that. But we had our differences, but not when it came to hitting that stage and, and doing, you know, what we loved doing. And... It was like instinct with her, like telepathy. And I, I don't think I've had that with anyone else in my life. And it was just one of those things. See, our personalities are so alike in so many ways and so different in so many ways. And we're both Italian and loud. And so some things would be, we would play it out. You know, we could, we could get loud. And um, if she didn't, you know, like something um, and was upset about it, you know, and I maybe took the other side of it, there would be squabbles. But in the end, you know, the entire experience, the entire, the entire thing was such a blessing and so much fun. And I couldn't have done it without her. I mean, there was no, you know, it just wouldn't have been the same. And I'm sure she'd say vice versa. And I have to say, we're great friends. She's one of my great, great friends. Just one of the greatest friends of my life.